Good evening everyone, this is Night Gazer, and tonight we're going to open up some card packs because why not, I guess. I haven't really made a video since like last week because work and life, just being busy overall. But I got like this one whole hot second to oh, make a video. In. Our little tavern is like an oasis in the desert. So I'm going to try that. But for the pack things, I kind of bought the one little bundle thing, the oh, what's it called? Actually, I'm forgetting. The Explorer Bundle, I bought this. The little legendary thing I got was the Warrior's Quest, which was kind of neat. But then I kind of used all my gold that I had left over to get some classic packs, because why not? calling. This card was recently nerfed. Highly disappointed, but these things happen. Sweeping Swipe isn't exactly a bad card, but it's just not that great. Common, 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 common. Yeah. Hecklebot's a good card. It's a big old top minion. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Magic carpet. I already have that. Unfortunate. Common, common. Legendary. To Rockets on Drumble. Gotta love them fireworks. Rare. Yeah. Seance is a good card. Allows you to copy yours and the opponent's minions. Might be a con, but it's pretty good. Rare. Golden Common! Not too bad. Shieldbreaker is a bad card, prove me wrong. Um, this is a good pack. Got a rare. I 
epic. God Roaster is a good card. Ooh, High Priest Takai. 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 Taki. I. It's an I at the end. Takai. That's exciting. Already have Soul Wardens, so that's just a hundred dust there. Sphere of the Raptor isn't a bad card. From what I've seen, most people don't really like Rocket Sun's Rumble, but I actually kind of like this stuff. Because this is a good card. This is a fun card. This is okay. That's terrible, but that's besides the point. On to the next pack. Or, well, we're on the Boomsday project now, but still. Common. Ooh, research project. That's a good part. Just a little mech card for Rogue. Two rares. Extra arms. Nice. Man. The Boomsday project features a lot of X. Because they had the new keyword magnetic. So if you play a mech on the left of a mech you already have on the field, it becomes attached to it, so the mech currently on the field will gain the attack and defense of the mech you just played, which is pretty nice. Man. That's a good card. Firework stuck. Last pack to the Boomsday. Rare. Common. 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 Astral Rift. Well, Boomsday was slightly disappointing. Nice of the Witch Wood. Common. 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 Rare. Rare. I like Blink Fox. Blink Fox is a solid card. Three mana, three. Three, that gives you another card. Not too shabby. The Wraith. Common, 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 rare. Forest Guide. At the end of your turn, both players draw a card. Interesting. Four mana, one four, but I mean, drawing cards is fun. Red Band Wasp, already have those. I'm mostly just looking for Tess Graving from the Witchwood, but unfortunately, she's a legendary. So I let's see if I didn't get her. Bane of Doom. Deal 2 damage to a character if that kills its own a random demon. I actually don't have this card, so that's new. That's cool. Rare, common, 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 common. Cold 
Masters a fun card. If you play this with the one of the newer cards from, uh, why am I forgetting things? Oh, well, but if, if you play this with a card from the Druid class called Bees, you summon four bees, attack into a thing four times. All the bees hopefully die, and then you just draw four cards. So that's pretty good. That's a neat little combo. Mostly common. Man. Not too shabby. I'm um, already at pounce. Not a big fan of golden cards. That's a lot of dust. Alright. That happened. Um, I'm pretty sure I already have baited arrows. I'll just jump that. Do I keep the mech, or do I disenchant it? That's the problem. Um, I know I already have this. It's a little old common card, so... I mean, yeah. If control is secret, gain plus one attack. I like golden weapons, but... The dust is needed. Yeah, I knew I didn't have any more Bane of Dooms. Hack the system. Attack five times with your hero. Reward. Interrupt core or whatever. Does something. I haven't used it yet. I mean. It's whatever. Summon a mech from hand and trigger its death rattle. I think I will disenchant this. I don't have it, but Rise of the Shadows is one of the newer sets. So I have a chance of getting it back. Hopefully. That's a solid maybe right there. G E N D A R Y Crafting hmm. I think I mostly just want to craft rogue cards. Because Edwin Van Cleve is a good card. And Tess is a really good card. Oh yeah, we'll do that. You have no idea what I'm capable of. Gonna make a Tess and gonna make an Edwin. Brotherhood shall prevail. The things I do to make a deck. Let's see. Hmm. Convert to standard. And we did it. We now have one of the little trial decks. So that's a thing now. 
let's have this as a different hero. Valera. You'll never see it coming. Um, as far as sleeves go. I think just the random one would be fine. Yeah. January 2018. Wow. August 2019. Actually, do I have enough wins? These are questions I should know, but eh. I think it's here. Yes, I do. still have this stack. Strange. Um, do I want Thief Rogue to be a wild deck though? That's the question. Eh, why not? Um, boop. Back to wild. And we're looking for cards that steal from the opponent. Um, discover a card from your opponent's class. That does fit. Do I want it? Um, Pilfer does the exact same thing, but it's for the classic set. But this allows me to see and choose, should say. But I think it's best to test the deck out as is. But the test screaming was the one legendary from the Witchwood that I've been trying to get. So I'm happy I had enough dust to actually just craft it as is. Valera versus Jaina. You asked for it. Watch your back. Do we keep Edwin? Like I never used the guy, so I don't know. I'll just keep him. I have the coin, so anything that's small I can use with him. Like, do I combo with the quest? That seems like an unnecessary pain, so let's not do that. Preparation's a good card. So I'll play that. Draw from Quest and Explorer. Then we'll go from there. The pleasure is mine. Hello. I wish they made more rogue skins for the hero. Because there's just an elf. Lyra. Of course it's the right way. Like, don't get me wrong, they're both nice skins to use. But like Mage has like three different ones. Wow. Oh, we got blink foxes. Discover a mage minion. Um, add four cards from other glasses to your hand. Thank you. Well, that worked out. Play Messenger Raven. And I can't see what that is. You played an elemental last turn.
draw a card. That's probably Bonfire Elemental then. Um, comboing with Van Cleef though is a better, so I think this is a 5 cost card. I'm not so sure though. Many discover, a secret, discover a secret, put it onto the battlefield, so that just gives me more value. But this gives me more armor. So right here we can do one, two, three, or no, one, two, three, four, five two, cards six. in the combo. This is going to get really big, but not right now. How much mana do I need actually for that? Um, I think just one, four, so I can do that next turn. That's fair. I'm assuming it might be Counterspell. I know it's not, or is it Ice Block? Crap, I am playing in Wild. Mistakes were made. Uh, play Coin. That works out. We play this. Deal for you. I'm gonna play this card. How much is this worth to you? Attack here. Kill this. Play that. And play it one. That was easy. 14-14. Let's go. Actually, gains plus two, plus two for each other card you played, so I played six cards in one turn. Not too bad. Uh, let's draw a card. Hey, we can combo. Nice. Um, somebody ram two cost minion, give a feather minion, plus one attack, and rush. Um... Three, six. I wonder. Ping. Yeah, I need to do that. Well played. Well, I like this deck. But now I know that it is ice block because this little this thing here that blocks a third of my screen. Disappointed. Okay, so if it is ice block, well, it is obviously. We need to get them as low as possible. So we're going to tap here. Smack here, smack here, um, play this, and we play this. Ha, this guy's toast. Lap dogs, all of you. Now my opponent's at two. Ice block saves them for one turn, which is nice, don't get me wrong. But now they're more manageable to deal with. Um, most likely another ice block, to be honest, if since he hasn't played it so far this game. He might have just top decked it, to be honest, though. Another water elemental. I think I can just complete the quest right now. I can actually. Um, add two random spells from another class to your hand. Play this. Okay, so it's not counterspell. Ha! I got counterspell. That's hilarious. Let's see. 
I'm immune while attacking, so this goes here. That goes there. And I know it's not counter spell, so I can play these safely. Hey, lights out. Another ice block. Right? So, no more ice blocks, and I have a counter spell set up. So I believe this should be game. Just gotta get rid of that guy. Oh, my weapon is three by itself. This ping is, this goes here, that goes there, this goes here. Uh, Puzzle box of Yaksharan. Well, I won. So that's exciting. Unfortunately, that because I won, I don't know what to do to change the deck. But I finally have a standard now that I actually like. Um, I'm pretty sure Bomb Warrior was nerfed. Quest Pal is non existent right now because I need two epic cards, I believe it's called. Actually, uh, let's see what were the cards that were nerfed. I'm um, a mage spell. It should be four now. Right here. It's recently modified, so disenchanting has been adjusted. I'm not using the card. So. Yeah. Now, what were the other two? Um, warrior. Right here, Dr. Boom. Do I? Hmm. I think it's better if I just keep him, because he is a good card overall. The other card that was nerfed, I think it was Barnes. Yeah, right here. Up to five. Oh. Barnes is in Mass Resurrection, so we'll play a game of this. Hopefully we get him in our opening hand, or draw into him. Because I need to see if playing him on 5 still works as good well. Anduin versus Rexar! Let the hunt begin. The light shall bring victory. Going first. Um, Sorrel minions with two or less attack. My opponent's a hunter, so my op he may have a lot of small guys for aggro. Um, this is a terrible hand. With your barns, we can win this. Greetings. Job done. Pew. Oh. Oops. Kill the opponent. Best play. Um, turn three, I can't do anything. Except heal now. Shadow Visions. I 
think that might be a better play though. Um, resurrect. He hasn't been doing anything aggro, so this may not help. It's one of five five copy of a random minion in your deck. I think I want that. Job done. Like sure, resurrecting something is good, but if he kills Barnes, then this does nothing on the next turn. So this is five. That's six. If my little one one dies. Well, if my 1-1 one, one dies, then this would be better, because I can just bring it back at full health, and so would this. So, 5, 2, plus 4, 6. All good. Okay, we're back to full HP. Hunter has a lot of secrets. Actually, Pressure Trap's one of the new ones. What does this do? As your opponent casts a spell, destroy a random enemy minion. Got something to hide? Well, oh, turn five barns. Tonight, a tale of terrible tragedy. I like where this is going. Okay, so he did kill it. So I'm gonna say it's like, I can just bring back two copies of that and call it good. But now that Barnes is in my kind of dead pool. Oh. The little graveyard thing or what have nots. Um, I can't play this, but do I want an obsidian statue? No. I said I didn't want the obsidian statue. What the gray? Oh well. This is fine. Mass hysteria is a board wipe. Shadow word horror. My opponent's not doing anything, so he's probably a secret hunter. As I was saying. Um, I might be seeing the spellstone next turn, honestly, though. Um, I'm not sure if I can handle that. Um, Shadow Visions helps. Get this. Can't play it because it's at 5. I'm pretty sure this was also nerfed at one point. That's just me though. Um, Smack Face. Turn to the hand. I can't play it now. I should have just left it as is. Mistakes were made. Um, the one secret he has on field might be a rat trap. Or no. This one's different. Turn set and the opponent's over only played one of each card. It's possible they have the one person in there. Phew. I can level that. I can level that. This is fine. Kill one of the minions. Yes! One of the bigger ones. So his little tutus can't do anything. I don't have to do anything now. Just kill his board. Oh wait, I have this thing. Um, 
to draw minions with two or less attacks that I can throw the wolves. How much was the other wolf? Um, it's a 3-3. Three, three. No, never mind. So yeah, this was probably a good play. I hope. Oh well. That's unnecessary. Oh, we got another Resurrect. That's fine. Let's see, sorry, minion with three or less attack. Played two cards already, so that might be Rat Trap. I really don't want to deal with a 6 6 on the board right now, considering how I don't have it fully under my control ish. But one card I should probably put in here is the uh, what's it called? Emperor Thorisan. He says that so long as he's on the field, well, so long as he is on the field, sorry. At the end of my turn, I can, well, it's a passive ability. He just discounts all cards in my hand by one. So this will go back to 10. This will be a 9. So on and so forth. But that means I can still play this. And that's what matters. Because the freezing trap makes me scared. Killing my things. My opponent probably has the one guy. Uh, who's the dinosaur person? Oh well. I forgot. Um, this plus that is fun. So I play this. Free of that blasted tower. Play that. And we pass the turn. Die, Behold. Holy obsidian statues, Batman. Like, I still have a Lich King, a Kel Taraz. Savannas in my deck, but no. Okay, this is fine. Control a secret at the end of your turn, restore four health to your hero. It's pretty cool. Quickly. Well, I can't just do that. No, it actually kills my Varg off. God dang it. Um, uh, resurrecting something would be probably be better. Some statue. Obviously. It's the only right answer. Kill that. No. Thank you. Heal this up a little bit. Call it good. Sorry, you with three or less attack. I don't want to do this. But if Ragnaros doesn't kill that, then he's just gonna kill him with so his statues. Scry more. Alright. Three three taunt. Alright. Behold! Tonight, a tale of terrible tragedy. I mean, 
it's not the worst thing ever. Okay, I got the obsidian statue, so I use like four of my mana to get a nine cost thing. And then I got a five cost. So it's like a 14 mana play. Not too bad. But well, no fog. No, I can see. Alright. Woo! I ranked up. That's mildly exciting. Alright, so the other card that got nerfed was Dr. Boom. Well, that's a standard deck. I don't like using standard decks in wild. Uh, uh, uh. Crossing over. Um, casual. Well, Thief Rogue was pretty fun to play with. Testing would be required for me to actually find out what would actually work best for it in the wild. But for right now, I think it's perfectly fine and standard. Um, let's get rid of that because it needs 10 mana crystals. Let's get rid of things. Not too bad. That's terrible. Does Quest Shaman have any weapons? I think a card I need to add to this deck would be Weapons Project. It gives both players a 2 2 weapon and 6 armor. So, like, I don't care if my opponent gets the armor, but I mean, if I use the weapon in conjunction with this, I get to draw 2. Or no, would it be a 2 3 weapon? Huh. Maybe. No, no. Add an element to your hand. That's just a waste. Master, master. Let's go face. Because he can't kill the 1-3 right now as it stands on the board. I hope you like my invention. Draw a card. That's a pain. A coin does nothing except get this out, but I don't need a 4 5. I think doing these two would be best. I want to test out Dr. Boom, but because it's 9 mana, I have to survive 6 more turns. My opponent is playing a very aggressive deck. This is actually a pretty good field. Oh, thank you. Light the fuses. Pow, 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 pow. Beautiful. This way I didn't have to waste the brawl. Opponent has four cards in their hand, I have five. Whenever you play a card with overload game, plus one, plus one. So we have to make it where you don't get overloaded, is what you're saying. Gotcha. Um, do I want to magnetize, or do I just want to use shield slam? 
I think having more cards on the beef, the feel of it does. Job's done. Plus this way I can save Zilliax for a later turn when I actually need the healing. Like this for example. Um, corrupt the waters. One card my opponent will most likely have in their deck is Shutterwalk. Um, did my opponent get coin? No, I had the coin. Never mind. I know what's happening. Um, a 3 3, so I can have Zilliax on the side and just kind of kill it. I think I like that, but. Does the quest shaman have any board wipes? Maybe. Th no, 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 no. I don't think so. <laughs> Gotta keep a wide board. My opponent. Wick. Wick had the earth shock, which was nice. I've got a huge guy. Not too bad. Opponent probably doesn't have a weapon. Silencing a minion is fun, but. I think I just play so Harrison Jones here. Choices. Trade my 3-3 three, three and hero that belongs in the is a taunt and he has life steal. So I preferably want to keep him on the field as long as possible. Sound Minion doesn't really help Your much. Wish is my huh. Wait, wouldn't it be through the same choice of cards? Curious. Fireball. Swipe. A bit rude, but all right. Uh, opponent has one bomb in their deck, so I'd get two little one ones. I know this needs to die. I'm almost at ten mana crystals. Um, so I think mean. playing this one. <laughs> enough as is, because otherwise I just won't have anything on board, and I can't exactly. Do that. Put your faith in the light. <sighs> I see how it is. Trade. Do one damage for each armor you have. Opponent's now down to 12. Oh, I should have used Spellbinder. Mm. That's not right. The one time I actually needed to silence something, I forget I have it. Dang it. From nothing. Okay, so my opponent is riding the value train right now. Which 
which isn't exactly good for me because this isn't going to be good. Control lack, you deal 3 damage. Too much value, not enough space. Wooly, hey. Um, I think Brawl would be good right here. Or Path works too, honestly. Just gotta use this three times so I still have mana left over. Pew. Alright. Just once then. My opponent plays a big thing, I can kill it. Pass me that arc -like scanner. It's not a big thing. What are you doing, my dude? End of your turn, draw a card. I deserve that. Actually, silencing Your that. Not Why is life hard? Uh, if he puts too much on the board, I'm probably going to have to sprawl. So I can do this. Job's done. That worked out. I was hoping to hit the two one, but I mean, whatever works. That's a bit unnecessary. Uh, how do I get out of this now? Just two of these, though. Mistakes were made. I should have swung with my weapon first. That way, I've gonna, that way I would have gotten more value out of it. Oopsie doopsie. See, he did have her. Missed out on four damage because I was the dumb. Ugh. That's a good card to get. That's a fun card to have. Do I just play it? No. It's a more of a reactive card. So I think I'll just pass that. They'll never know what to do. Not 
not too bad. It's like life drinker, but worse. Wow. Drink with me, friend. So we play this. Kill my bones board. Play this. Defend the gates. To me. Kill that. Oh, good. My opponent has eight cards in their deck. I have ten. My opponent has low wealth. Low health. Ow. They'll never know what hit him. I think that just wins me the game. Because my opponent should have three bombs in their deck. Because I don't think any of them went off yet. And with my opponent being at four, he should be getting a bomb soon. That actually matters. This will be a five, that's three, so I can still kill that, but I mean Engaging TC one thirty mental dislocator. Ow. Ow. Cool. Defend the gates! Come on, I do me! Seriously? My opponent has four bombs in their deck and he hasn't drawn a single one. Okay. Well played. Like this is standard, not wild, so I know he doesn't have Reno. He can't restore to full HP, so I don't know how my opponent gets out of this. That's a mild problem, but whatever. That works. In case he doesn't. Yes! Thank you. Sweet cranberry pie. Well, that was fun. Going into the collection. Do 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 do. Um, I actually didn't see Doctor Boom that entire game, but he would have helped a lot had I gotten him. So that's not a big deal. One thing I can do is put in hack the system and some weapons. I'm mostly thinking something along the lines of weapons project. Because I give my opponent a weapon and then I can just destroy it. Oh wait, I have this girl lady. Huh. Alright. Yeah, two, three weapons, so I would draw three cards off of that. Seven mana draw three is terrible up until you see that you have a 5-4 on the field too. 
and a 2-3 weapon of your own and gain 6 armor, so that's pretty good altogether. What do I take out though? Hmm. Probably Alex Straza. My deck does a lot of pressure by itself where it doesn't really need her. If I take out Dr. Boom. But Maxwell Rush is fun. Probably regret this later, but for the time being, I'll be fine. But weapons project, do 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 do. I have enough weapons in the deck already. Two wrench calibers. Got a super collider because that's very fun to use. But I'm going to work on Bomb Warrior to become more of a quest warrior because I want to use Hack the System. Doo doo. See, the other color that was nerfed was Barnes, but at 5 mana, he still works pretty well. He gives the opponent a little bit more time to actually set up. So I think that's fair. I'm fine with that. Let's see, what was I going to make though? Let's see, I have 21 under dust. It's not a bad card. So I'm just missing one more thing from this deck. Go um, two one cost minions from your deck. One minus C O S T. Enter. Um, put a one cost minion from each deck into the battlefield, and this says place seven one cost minions. So I don't. I'm not sure if those two work together. Whenever you play a one cost minion, draw a spell from your deck. Oh, I already had one in the deck already. Well, now there's a second one. Actually, how many spells are there? Not a lot. So, cutting that, adding this. I think that should work. Let's test it out. You and casual. 
because the best way to test out a terrible deck, or at least any deck in general, is to play casual eyes. Because I don't know what I'm doing with this. I know I'm playing one cost cards, but these things happen. Let's the hunt begin. Um, get rid of that. I like this card. I don't need a second, please. Okay. Greetings, Traveler. I wanted to do nothing, so I played both of these. Hopefully my opponent doesn't have anything with taunt. Because if both of these attack face, then I get two copies to hand. One for each. And then I'll be almost done with my quest already. <gasps> Gasp. Pew, pew. Um, I think I'll just play or no. If you play a one cost minion, draw a spell from your deck, so I need to save up spells for that. Plus if I just empty out my hand here, if my opponent boards wipes, I don't have anything. So me actively holding back is probably the best choice. You win this time. A stone. Amazing. Alright. The Marsh Queen is officially a good deck. Or that was probably one of the stronger starts. Either way, I won. So I think that was overall a good little experience thing. I didn't really get to play that much. I played two cards. My opponent quit. But well. Um, thanks for watching. I apologize if the video was too long, but still. I hope you enjoyed the video. And that shall be it for tonight. So, until next time.